Unique cicadas are beginning to emerge from underneath East Tennessee. These types of bugs only come out every 17 years. People across several states have reported brood X cicadas sittings, uh, sightings, excuse me, in total. Billions of the bugs will cover the areas highlighted in yellow. And they will be sitting soon. Yeah, so that's you weren't true. far off. That's true. That is true. Thank uh -huh. you, Beth. I appreciate that. Yeah. Uh, some of you are spotting these cicadas as they begin to burrow their way to the surface. One viewer sent us this photo of a brood X cicada in Dandridge. And wait, oh, there's more. Here's some video from Northwest Knox County of the oh. bus. Ew. Ew. Okay. Ew. Creepy crawly. And as more cicadas come out in hundreds or thousands begin to cover front and backyards, you may worry about damage to your property. It's not the only thing I'm going to be worried about. <laughs> 10 News reporter <laughs> Shannon <laughs> Smith explains the impact cicadas could have. As the brood 10 cicadas make their way out of the ground, you may be wondering, are these bugs going to impact my yard? The yes and no. You may see some shells litter your yard as they shed their underground casings, and they'll be loud hanging out at the tops of your trees. But these cicadas are overall good for your garden. As they tunnel through the soil and, and underneath uh, feeding on tree roots, they're not harming the trees, but in fact are aerating that soil and providing a benefit there. The only damage you may run into is if you have new young trees. When the female cicada lays her eggs, she actually cuts the uh, end of the twigs on the branches and inserts her eggs into those. So it can sometimes cause damage, but really only the youngest or most fragile trees would be at, at any risk. They won't bite or sting you, so just let them be and sit back and watch the once in every 17 year spectacle. I'm Shannon Smith. And coming up on 10 News at 5 and 6, our cicada coverage continues. Find out just how loud these bugs are, plus when we can expect them to emerge in mass. And find out if calling pest control can help limit the cicadas in your yard. Well, interesting questions. And by the way, we want to see your cicada photos or video. Show us what the bug invasion looks like in your life. And they are all over your yard. If that's the case, or interrupting your child's sports game, or maybe you're joining some and cooking and eating the cicadas. Excuse me? I have done it. We did it 17 years ago here on Live at 5. What well, it may have been Live at 5 back then at IM's Nature Center. Dip it a little ranch, a little crunchy, kind of like chicken. Anyway, if you try it at home, send us your photos, 865-637-1010, and you may see them right here on Channel 10.